There are now five mainline Pokemon games available on the Nintendo Switch, each with their own shiny hunting methods. But today, I'm going to be shiny hunting on hard mode. Starting with Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee. Uh, so like, what actually is hard mode? Well, shiny hunting on hard mode means that I can only use limited shiny hunting techniques, which each game has their own specific limitations. For example, in Let's Go Pikachu, I can only get up to a chain of 11, which only boosts your shiny odds to about 1 in 585. Well, actually, if you really wanted to hunt on hard mode, you would just restart your games, get rid of the shiny charm, and hunt at full odds. True, but with my ADHD, there's no way I'm spending months shiny hunting on full odds, and come on, these people need a video. So I decided that I was going to start out on Route 15 and begin chaining the Pokemon Venonat. However, my target isn't actually Venonat. My true target is going to be- OH MY GOSH! What's even more insane is finding a shiny Chansey into only 12 encounters! What are you- Dude, this is a 20 minute recording with the chain and then the shiny Chansey! Oh my gosh, okay. Okay. Come here, you green guy! You tan and green! Oh my gosh! Okay, excellent throw. Two Premier Balls. It deserves to go in the Premier Ball. Come on, stay in there. 12 encounters. Oh my goodness. That is insane. That's right. My true target is one of the most common shiny Pokemon you could find in the Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee games. Chansey. One of the more rare Pokemon that you could find, and in most games it only has like a 2% spawn rate. You see, Chansey is one of the 9 available Pokemon that you can catch in every single game on the Nintendo Switch. So if you want to see me do this challenge again, be sure to comment down below one of these Pokemon for me to shiny hunt for. Since that entire hunt only took like 30 minutes, let's move on to the next game. Pokemon Sword and Shield. And for this game, our target is, you betcha, Chansey. Except this is going to be way more difficult than it was in Let's Go. I'm talking like hours longer. <laughs> It should have been days if you were actually full odds hunting. You see, Chansey can only be found in the wild in the DLC area in the Isle of Armor at a 2% spawn rate, making it so you're lucky if you even see one on the screen. But there's more to hard mode than just rare spawn rates. In this game, if you battle over 500 of a species, it increases your shiny chances to about 1 in 455. Oh, so you probably like already battle 500 Pokemon to increase your odds, I bet, didn't you. I wish I did that. You see, I ended up checking my Pokedex and I only battled seven. So even with the shiny charm, our best luck was one out of 1024. So I started hunting. It's crazy to me coming back to this game. It is crazy to me that they don't have overworld shinies in this. Like what a huge missed opportunity. Soon enough, I got up to 50 Chansey battled and increased my shiny odds to 1 out of 819. And then after two hours, I got over 100 Chansey battled. But at this point, I started to catch on to this little trick that I found. I remember a weird, a strange technique that if you stood in the grass after you encountered the Pokemon, I, the odds of that Pokemon spawning in again increased. I don't know if that's actually numerically or statistically true, but it's a, it's a small little thing that I personally noticed. So I stay here, and we get another Chansey. Yep. So you can almost sort of chain in this. Uh, you do realize that chain doesn't actually increase your shiny odds or anything, right? <laughs> yeah, dork, I do know that. But technically speaking, it does help me see more Chansey. And seeing more Chansey means a better chance at finding a shiny Chansey. Soon enough, I passed over 200 encounters, and I was starting to realize that this hunt was probably going to take a while as i started to flash back to some of my longer hunts in this game the next chancy popped up i ran into it only to find that shiny chancy oh my goodness 213 encounters i'm so pumped right now considering this is our second shiny chancy of the video we might as well use a repeat ball boom Next, we go to the games that most people probably want to forget, and that's Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. You mean the game that is actually a one-to-one -one remake perfect to the originals that everybody asked for, but ultimately just got mad at when they got exactly what they asked for? Yep. 
In these games, Chansey actually has a few different places that it can spawn in, including Route 209, 210 South, and if you're lucky, the Trophy Garden. But I wasn't so lucky. Not only that, but the shiny charm in this game literally only works for eggs. That stinks. Poor little casual shiny hunter can't get fast shiny Pokemon. <laughs> Boo hoo. <laughs> oh, just you wait, my friend. So for this hunt, we're going to be doing the Pokey Radar technique. But the catch is that I cannot go over a chain of 17. That's going to be the technique for this. Hopefully it works out nice and easy for us. But just chaining doesn't make it a hard mode challenge does it no 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 the challenge for this game is that i cannot go above a chain of 17 which makes my shiny odds roughly one out of 1986 and believe it or not we actually got a really good chain going on our first chancy we're at 10 that's pretty good so far we're doing good we're doing good we got a chain of 10 going only seven more and then we just reset and just like that, we lost our chain for doing absolutely nothing wrong. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention that this method kind of sucks. You see, when chaining, you can do absolutely everything correct, but you still have a really good chance at just randomly breaking your chain. Can't make it up. I just can't make it up. One, two, three, four. Nine. Chain of nine. I hate this game, dude. This game's such trash. trash. But as I was just searching for a Chansey, I ended up finding something else. I just found a random shiny Starly while trying to get this Chansey right now. And, uh, shiny Starly. <laughs> Three days have passed at this point. I've seen over 2,000 chances. No shiny. So I press on. Another chain. But this one was different. So I tested my luck. All right. This is it. I made it to a chain of 11. I managed to get up to a chain of 16. And I only needed one more chancy. Officially at a chain of 17. And this is the highest I can go, and it's time to do some resets. Let's freaking go. I'm so pumped. I'm so pumped. I'm so pumped. Okay, here we go. I hate this game. I hate this game with so much burning passion. This game is so bad. This game is an obje objectively bad game. Why? Immediate regret. Well, that's what you get for trying to use this super easy shiny hunting technique. What do you want, like free shiny Pokemon? Not now, Cannon 2. After the devastation that just happened, I was drained, but I had to keep going. Yet, before I could even find another Chansey... Okay, uh, there's a shiny something on my screen. I don't have a single chain, as you can tell. I have no idea what this Pokemon's going to be, but it's the first time I've seen Sparkles since doing this hunt at 1972 Chansey encounters. Let's see what this Pokemon is. If this is a Chansey, I might poop my pants. Oh, it's another Starly. No, dude. Yep, just another Starly. Finally, I found another Chansey and this time I was not going to take any risks. So instead of getting up to a chain of 17, I decided to just stop at a chain of 11 and just reset the spawns over and over and over again. Hours went by with this chain of 11 until it was bedtime. When I came back, it was a new day and I had a fresh stock of blind optimism. <gasps> yes! That's a shiny patch, and that means that that is a shiny Chansey. 3,468 shiny Chansey in BDSP. Yes! Oh, I've never been so excited to see those green ears. Come on. Yes! Shiny Chansey! The next game is arguably the best Pokemon game available on the Nintendo Switch. 
Pokemon Legends Arceus. Okay, now you're really, really pulling my leg. This game is so easy to find shiny Pokemon in that you really don't even need to look for them. You just fly around, wait to hear the sound effect, and then you just go to it. It's so easy. You just get like hundreds of shinies all the times. Well, lucky for you, Hotshot, we're shiny hunting on hard mode. But yes, my nosy counterpart is correct. This game is arguably the easiest and has the most insane shiny luck out of any Pokemon game ever. But that's why we made it hard mode. We're going to be hunting for a shiny Alpha Chansey, a rare version of the Pokemon that is hyper aggressive and like four times the size of a normal Pokemon. It has a shiny odds of about 1 in 585, that is, if you perfected the Pokedex. Which, yes, I, I did prep for this one. Freaking Cheetah? I decided to start this hunt by doing a live stream here on YouTube, which reminds me, you should subscribe down below so you don't miss out on all the fun. There's one particular area in these games that guarantee an alpha chance you to spawn it, and that is the Cobalt Coastlands. Going down this path here, you- Oh, the first random shiny is a shiny weasel. Right, um, well, there's our first shiny. <laughs> As I was saying, if you head down this path here... Oh, wait. Oh, another shiny? I was like, I heard some sparkles there. Shiny Apalm. Heck yeah, chat. Look at this pink boy. Anyway, continue down this path, jump off this cliff, fly over to this little island, and sure enough, you find yourself an Alpha Chansey. Okay, we made it. The stream went on, and we actually did find a shiny Chansey from an outbreak, but... Shiny Chansey! Oh, but it's not an alpha! No! Yeah, that one hurt a little bit. But then we went on to find a few more shiny Pokemon. Oh, another shiny! A shiny Drifloon! Oh, that's a shiny Glammeow. I saw that before the sparkles. Oh, yes! A shiny... I don't have... Ooh, stop it, don't run away. Stop it, don't run away. Oh my gosh, that was so scary. Oh, uh, that is a feels bad. Is that another shiny Glammeow? Oh my gosh, are you serious? Oh, there's a shiny over there. And it, but it's not, What? A, what is that? A shiny Remory? Maybe we'll find another random Wurmple or something on the way. Oh my gosh, I was kidding. And it is a Wurmple. <laughs> there's an Alpha Drifloon. You open up some packs today, can oh, 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 that is a shiny Alpha Dustnor. Shiny Alpha Dustnor, please stay in your ball. I beg of you. Let's go! Shiny Alpha Dustnor has been caught. So you're telling me that I can find a shiny Alpha Dustnor, which only spawns at night, but I can't find a shiny Chansey that is a 100% guaranteed spawn? Okay. Yeah, so, uh, I ended the stream. So, BDSP was a long hunt, to say the least. This hunt, though, this is something that I wouldn't even wish on this guy. Day two happened, and I found a shiny Apom, Drifloon, and then a Combi. Day three happened, shiny Remoraid, Apom, and a shiny Alpha Eevee? Are you serious? Yo, oh... My gosh, that is a shiny Alpha Eevee. That looks so good. I could get two shiny Alpha Pokemon, but not one that is guaranteed to spawn. No, I get one that only spawns at nighttime and another one that doesn't even guarantee that it's an Alpha. It just so happens to be a shiny Pokemon and an Alpha at the same time popping up, but I can't get the one that's always there. No, 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 no. That would be too good. This is getting so freaking Day four. I went out and ran the same route I ran over 200 times by now and found myself a shiny Staravia, a Palm, another shiny Starly, and a shiny Glammeow. Day 5. I'm feeling good about this one. I'm at 300 encounters over halfway of my odds and have this gut feeling that it will just shine soon. Shiny on the first run through, let's make it happen. Wait a second, something shined as soon as I opened up the menu. Togepi! Shiny Togepi! 
Let's go, Shiny on the first run through. Shiny on the first run through. Shiny on the first run through. Shiny just ran away from me on the first run through. I hate this game. Well, that's one way to start the day. Oh, <laughs> uh, after that disaster, we got another shiny Psyduck, three shiny Apoms, a Starly, a Drifloon, Shadot, Glammeow, and even another shiny Eevee. I told you that game was so easy. They literally hand out shinies like it's candy on Halloween. Who? What do you mean, who? Who asked? Day six. It's Friday. I have nothing to do besides sit down and grind for this shiny. So off I flew. I found a shiny Remoraid, shiny Psyduck, shiny Staravia, and Drifloon. Another shiny Apom. Shiny. Somewhere. Over here. Shiny Apom. Oh my gosh. And is, is it going to run away? Okay. Let's not fail this. We failed it. And just like when you tried to catch a legendary Pokemon back when you were a kid, and you would look off and pretend that you don't care if it stays in the Pokeball, it happened. Oh my gosh! Yes! There it is! Ah! <laughs> oh my gosh! 534 encounters! Shiny Alpha Chansey! Oh, it's been a full week of shiny hunting for this thing. Oh my gosh. Just look at this. Look at it. Oh, that's filled with rage and fueled with fiery blast of evil. Ah! <laughs> yes! There it is. <laughs> it's a real thing, dude. Oh my gosh. Look at it. Hours. Hours of my life. Oh, shiny Alpha Chansey. Let's go. It's over. It's over. Oh my gosh. Thank God. That took so, so long. Okay, so that was pretty impressive. I'm going to be honest. But, like, don't you still have another game to shiny hunt in? Yes. Yes, I do, Canon 2. But can I just bask in this glory for a second? Sure, but to my knowledge, they want to move on to the next game already. Fine. We'll move on to Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Okay, so because you're doing hard mode, let me guess. You're going to use a sparkly encounter sandwich without any encounter power to help boost the spawn rate. Uh, yes, actually. That's, that's exactly what we're going to do. This was it. The last and final game, Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. In these games, Chansey can be found in the very back of the map next to the Team Star Fairy Base. So off I went. I made my first sparkling sandwich, which helped boost the shiny odds to about 1 in 683, and ran around like a madman just praying that a Chansey will spawn. After trying to run around for like 20 minutes, I decided that I was just going to stay in place and auto-battle the Pokemon around me, to help prevent groups of Pokemon taking up my spawn pool. And as I was attacking this group of Fomantis, my Gallade just stopped. Wait. Is that a shiny Fomantis? Oh my gosh, it's a full on shiny Fomantis! Oh heck yeah! Let's throw a dust ball at it. <laughs> what? <laughs> what a happy accident. Then finally, on day two of shiny hunting in Pokemon Scarlet, 60 hours between five games i finally found the fifth and final shiny chancy <gasps> there it is wait 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 floet move 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 there's the shiny chancy yes yes yeah shiny chancy yes shiny chancy oh my gosh it's so tan and green just like my background Yes! Shiny Chansey! Finally! And if you guys want to see more shiny hunting shenanigans, be sure to hit this video right here, and I'll see you in the next one.